Hello! In this video, we will learn to use the distributive property. The distributive property allows us to break a number into parts to make a problem easier to solve. Then we distribute the numbers in the number sentence. Let's see what this means. We can use the distributive property to solve 13 times 3 is equal to n. We can break the larger number, 13, into two smaller numbers that add up to 13. Because we have simple rules for multiplying by 10, we can use 10 plus 3, which is equal to 13. Now we just need to distribute or share so both numbers get multiplied by 3. We can rewrite the problem as 10 times 3 plus 3 times 3. 10 times 3 is equal to 30. And 3 times 3 is equal to 9. 30 plus 9 is 39. So, 13 times 3 is equal to 39. To solve 18 times 2 using the distributive property, we can break the larger number, 18, into parts. 10 plus what is equal to 18? 8. Now that we have broken apart the 18, we just need to multiply each number by 2. 10 times 2 is equal to 20. 8 times 2 is equal to 16. 20 plus 16 is equal to 36. So, 18 times 2 is equal to 36. And that's how you use the distributive property. See you next time!